Well, Macon Bibb commissioners have a big decision to make on whether or not to spend money to fix some of Macon's tennis courts. Our Abby Casoris joins us in studio to explain. Hired a temporary tennis consultant to survey the courts, and then she came back with an estimate for repairs. After the last eight weeks, she says it would cost the county about $65,000, but if they don't, it could cost them some tournaments. This is David Knapp's first time playing tennis at Tattnall Square Park. Oh, there it goes. The courts are all right. There are definitely some big cracks, and you know, right now they're not a huge problem, but. I could see down the line it becoming an issue like they get bigger, it becomes like more uneven. Those cracks continuing to grow because the courts have not been resurfaced in seven years. We just had a national tournament here and we had um, the top juniors from about 40 states from around the country and these are the condition our nets are in. Jamie Kaplan spent the last eight weeks surveying the courts, reporting back to Bibb County Commissioners. That it was said, well, I don't know how serious Macon is about their tennis. She estimates that it would cost $65,000 to resurface the courts at Tattnall Square Park and John Drew Smith Tennis Centers. But the U.S. Tennis Association would match the county's investment up to $60,000. Done by the, the companies that have done these courts because there are there is some concern. Kaplan says if the county doesn't invest, they could risk losing tournaments. Visit Macon estimates in 2018, more than 4,500 hotel and motel rooms were bought for the tournaments, and there was a 3.2 million dollar impact. <sighs> Either way, Knapp says he's glad to have a place to hit the ball around with his dad, regardless of the cracks. Nope. Let me try to serve. Last time those courts were resurfaced was seven years ago, and Kaplan says they should be resurfaced every five to seven years. Chelsea, back to you. All right, thank you, Abby. Kaplan's appointment is temporary. The county discussed hiring someone full-time or as a tennis pro or looking internally to fill that position.